Inspired by Live Aid, I went to Ethiopia to live in the nunnery. There's a lot to unpack there, yeah. Frank's team. Where do you want to start? Live Aid happened in what year? Oh, so I was still in primary school because I also wrote a song for Live Aid thinking that I got to keep the money. I feel like Live Aid was 1984. I'm just guessing that. So, 84, I was born in 75, so I'm not good at maths. I'm a wordsmith. Nine. nine. Can I, so, at uh, nine, how did your f parents feel about you going and living in a nunnery in Ethiopia when you were nine? I didn't go when I was nine. Oh, OK. Ooh, waited till she was ten and off she <laughs> went. Can I, can I just clarify what Live Aid is for those of us who might not know? So, just you, then. So, um... <laughs> <laughs> There are people watching at home from Sri Lanka who don't know what live aid is. Do the people in Sri Lanka, do they know it's Christmas time at all? <laughs> I get that reference. <laughs> You're going to love so this. Is that... that comes from live aid. Oh, right. What was your follow-up? Was it more inclusive? Like, do they know it's Ramadan as well? <laughs> oh my, Any, anyone I, know when oh my Hanukkah God, is? If I told you, you'd get me cancelled, but it came from the heart. But I was nine, and me and my brother wrote it. It was called Help Them, They Need All the Help They Can Get. <laughs> which is just atrocious. Well, but it was a nine-year-old sentimentality and we sang it in assembly and we were allowed to. And... Give us some of the other yeah. lyrics. This is so... Please cut it if I'm going to get cancelled because we went it really from... It's a nine-year-old's brain. I didn't have a frontal cortex yet. <laughs> <laughs> what would you do if you saw an Ethiopian? Would you stop and give them some food? We say yes, 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 because if you didn't, that would be rude. Help them. <laughs> Help them. Sorry, I, I just need to know. Wait, sorry. Where do I, where do I donate? Where do I donate? <laughs> so what age did you go to the nunnery? How old were you? Uh, 18, I reckon. And how long were you there? I was scheduled to be there for six months, but I got kicked out of the nunnery oh. after just three. I got a hickey. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, wow. How did you get the hickey? Passing. For who? From, from the nuns or the Ethiopians? <laughs> <laughs> no, but there was a pregnant nun. Work that one out. <laughs> um, yeah, so... Um, so, yeah, it was one of those uh, aid missions that probably doesn't do any good. I, with this beautiful accent, was sent to help the country by speaking English. To who? The Ethiopians. <laughs> At 19. I know, and but what they really wanted, because English wasn't the problem, it's like they wanted to know how to run schools, and I'd never worked in a school. I'd left school early. I'd, I'd know I was not a help. I was probably a drain. And <laughs> I also... The nuns came in one day and said, um, OK, just be careful. Tomorrow we're going uh, into the city, but there's going to be a coup. And I was like... <laughs> <laughs> and I was like... What do we wear? Will there be food? <laughs> <laughs> Were the nuns trying to overthrow the regime? Because <laughs> in my experience, coups happen by surprise. But the nuns are like... No, I think, don't I think they got their ear to the ground, Don't the nuns. tell anyone. <laughs> <laughs> what was the name of the place? Where you were, the, the actual loca geographical location in Ethiopia? Nuns are us. <laughs> <laughs> um, None of your business. <laughs> what was the name of the specific... You know, the convent. The convent. Oh, I wouldn't... I'm not a details person, but... How uh, convenient. I, I, think, I, <laughs> I think it was Our Lady of the Slightly Loose Morals. <laughs> Truth or a lie? Well, I, think, I think it's true. Let's, I think we're going to go, gonna, we're gonna go with it. it unless you, unless no, you're feeling lie. Going, no, if you think lie, lie, then definitely. My initial thought is it's true. Yep, so we're going to say All true. Right, we're going with true. Georgie, is that true or a lie? Uh, that is the truth. Oh! Well, have you to your wow. Georgie's charity ended when the only thing she could give away was her neck for hickeys. <laughs> <laughs>